It can be very annoying for students to constantly be seeing assignments inside their to-do list that they can't actually complete because it's past due and it's been locked or maybe gone from quarter one to quarter two or quarter three to quarter four. And so um, the reason why they continue to see it though in their to-do list is that the status code that is applied to that assignment is maybe missing or late. Um, and so the reason why that happens is that once a status code is applied to an assignment, the only way it changes is that if you manually go in there and change it. Okay? So if you have not been changing the status code when you go in and grade a late assignment, then it stays as missing even if it has a grade, even if it shows that it's uh, been submitted. And so I want to show you a, a quick way that you can go in and clear out a lot of those missing assignments, either excusing them or um, saying that they're late or just change it, taking the status off entirely. It's entirely up to you, but this is how you do it. So uh, I'm just in a generic grade book here and I removed some student names since this is a real grade book. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to use the status window to change uh, the statuses. You can see that the pinks are all ones that are missing. Uh, a blue is late in, well, if it's if it's white, it has um, no status, gray is excused. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna click on one of these pink ones. And you, and you notice that right here, there's a little uh, arrow. Okay, so I'm gonna click that. We're gonna move me and make me small. There we go. And so you can see that uh, it has a different status here and that it, this has a status of missing. Okay. Um, now, again, you can change the status to whatever you want, but I want to change these quickly uh, to none. These are all quarter three. As you can see that I'm only showing quarter three right now. And so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to hit none. And then right here, I'm going to hit to the next, uh, the next box. Okay. The next cell in the, the spreadsheet and just doing that over and over this does take a few minutes of course okay but you can see that already I've cleared out a bunch then I can go to the next row and do the same thing and what that's gonna do is it's going to show the status uh, it's gonna show no status to the student it's no longer gonna be in there in their to-do list Okay. So it does take a little bit of time, but uh, again, the best way is to stay on this as you are grading assignments to actually change the status right there if you have a, an assignment that is submitted late. Otherwise, if you've gotten a backlog and it's quarter four and you need to change a bunch of quarter three things, take 30 minutes, sit down, clear out all those mess, uh, statuses, and your students will be good to go. Cheers.